All right, guys, so now let's look at a first time customer. How do you handle the timeline with your new customers? And you have to understand there's a proper time to ask the customer about the timeline. Most service advisors fail at this because they will ask the, the right questions at the wrong time. Meaning, if you're ready to make a sales presentation to a customer, the customer knows the phone call's coming. Okay, here's a sales pitch. And if it's at that point in time that you start asking the customer about how long they wanna keep their vehicle and try to identify the timeline at that point, guess what happens? The customer puts up roadblocks. They're gonna be guarded with their information. They're not gonna tell you the truth because they think that the information they give you could cost them more money. So now what I'm doing as a consumer is I'm protecting my wallet. Okay, so the right time to ask for the timeline information is that initial write-up. So what I want you guys to do is really look at your initial write-up process. Are you spending enough time with the customer to ask the right questions at the right time when they don't feel like you're trying to sell them something because it's a huge transformation. Now, once you get the timeline information, make sure that you guys are documented in your software system properly so we don't ask the same rhetorical questions over and over again every time the customer comes in. So the big message here is identify the timeline with first time customers so your new customers get the timeline information at initial write up.